Okay, hi everyone, welcome to the Stuff and Talk show. So today, again, we're just going to be resuming the first Let's Play. And so with that said, let's just get started here. Act 1. That bed looks stiff as hell. God, are you sure you're not sleeping on rocks? Look at that. Well, that's a pretty cool room, though. This is the part that I always get lost. I always get lost in this part. And there it is. Learning. And there's my samurai. So, this is what I'm going to do first, right? First, I'm going to save. I ain't going to do it often, you know, Skyrim style. And also, um, I actually got this from a tip. I forgot his name. Uh, I believe it was CC CCJ. Uh, I'll, I'll kind of include it in the links here. And he was saying the best thing that you can do. Yes. Okay. Sorry. Back with it here. Uh, so again, it's always good to get a muzzle or to get a silencer on everything just because that will really help you with your aim down the line so again something that I recommend and yes not sure if this is for my samurai or not but again we are going to see real quickly here I am going to add this attachment here And we're gonna go all the way over here. Not many people probably know this, but again, this really can help you a bunch. Of course, then let me see it, bro. Right, uh, so by seven. And we're gonna go with crit chance. No, okay. Um, let's get up, yeah. And then there you go. So basically, I'm going to be quite OP for quite a while now. Just because I have this. And this is what you ideally want with this build. You're going to want a crit mod for your sword. So again, you never know when things get messy and you have to start all over. So, I'm going to collect my gun. Alright, so we're going to go meet our good friend Jackie. I mean, I mean, even look at that. I mean, you know, I, of course I don't really kind of pay attention to the news, but things like that. But it's really cool, like, how they really included, in a way, like, these type of news. Because there's that guy, and then there's another one as well. So there's two kind of news going on, which I think is really cool. So it's kind of like different politics in a world that you don't even know. I love it. Okay. Got it. Yeah, so you may see some of the my frames may drop a little bit. It'll happen you know, from time to time. Uh, so again, we'll just have to kind of play it by ear. But normally it's in populations like this where there's lots of people going on. Heck is that? That looks disgusting. Uh, props on just chopsticks. I can do that. Are you serious? The Passion of Christ. Don't know how I feel that Jesus Christ is referenced in Cyberpunk. Okay. So what's the gig? Okay, interesting. I just noticed that. Well, our wants to tell you 
I thought it's just so cool. I mean, the different customizations. Not only can you like customize them to what you want. It's the kind of like the cybernetics, kind of like on the cheeks and things like that. This is so cool. All right, let's hear what old Dex has to say. Set it up. Now it'd be really cool if you could actually customize the color of those. Just imagine me pimping, have all gold everything, all gold implants. Dude, that would be cool. Alright, so now what we're going to do, I believe that's my car. Alright, so we are now not dying. Uh, because we have some cheap OP cops over this way. And we're going to go to the Ripper Dock. And if you didn't know, this is basically where you're going to be getting your upgrades, your any cybernetics, and things like that. So, good stuff. Yeah, look at that setup. You know what? Who needs doctors when you can just put metal in you and there you go? Why not? Oof, Jesus Christ. He's working on me? No, thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> That's not even the cringy part. The cringy part's when he actually put that in your eye. That is cringy. Alright, so, again, obviously we are restricted with what we can do. Uh, some things that I'm looking forward here. I want to get this. This increases my carrying capacity. Something I will be getting. I'm not too involved in hacking. I've done it before and I just don't like it. So again, not something I'm too interested in. Something here I want to get is the Mantis Blades. I will get that. Although there's, um, I've, I've seen plenty of builds that basically have like free legendary ones you can find. I uh, just haven't gone that far in the mission to actually uh, take advantage of those. But it's definitely something I am looking forward to. And also, in c when it comes to legs here, I'm definitely getting both of these. So, something that I will be doing, uh, but obviously in this case we have the eyes. And also, in this case, the hands. Like Alright. Jesus Christ. I would hope so. He just literally stuck that right in my eye socket. And I'm going to feel some discomfort. I think you're really understatement there. <laughs> okay, so again, I can now... That's just really cool. I mean, I would love to have eyes that has like a built-in scanner. That would be pretty dope. Okay, well, yeah. Okay, great. Oof. And that's not painful at all. <laughs> Still pretty cool. That is pretty cool, though. I will have to admit, I mean, to have cybernetics like that, uh, sign me up. I would do that any day. Yeah. That trigger, that trigger, fitch, uh, that trigger finger is itching. Alright, so again, I'm going to drop down a quick save here, and from there, we are just going to get going here. We're going to meet Deshaun. A wannabe rapper, at least looks like one. It's like Snoop Dogg, except fat as can be. Alright, so we are now going to see Deshaun. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds. 
but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. No, if I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tech hits the scene. Do you but remember, really believe you're not there to execute anybody. You're Try to incapacitate the attacker, the and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Cameras are all around us, even with this. Alright, so while she's done yapping, I believe there's a little quest here. Let's just say you're right. Again, this is like if you want to leave some quick points here, some quick money or something like that. You know what? This is the way to do it. I think I did this quite late, but I didn't know you could actually do this so close by, which is even better. Some setup there. I mean, God. Oh God. <laughs> I feel like those are the ones that are just complete outcasts. <laughs> You're not going anywhere in life, dude. And you're definitely no prophet. All he's doing is missing his little tin can hat. Tin can hat the prophet. Okay. That's it? Okay, cool. Well, okay. I thought you'd get some points for that, and I guess I didn't. It's perfectly fine. Uh, so, we're going to now move right along here. Again, drop it down, quick save. If you didn't know, I impulsively do that. What's going on here? Okay, we got we got some action here that we can get involved in. Oh crap! I did not mean to do that. And is there anyone else over this way? Ooh, you bud. I love this. I love the dismemberment, just kind of slashing away and cutting off heads. Beautiful, realistic, and gory. Amazing. And on that note, we can have a little mask here, which is cute. Okay, that works. <laughs> Whatever. Why do you not have your jacket on? And in this case, right, okay, so again, some nice little missions there, this, you, you'll be surprised, random shooting, and sometimes you get really points for that too, which is really great, you get points and uh, you get like, you have like these little cr crimes, crime reports, so basically by simply helping out, it's pretty solid. You know, a win-win situation. Jesus, he looks like he could rip your arm off. And Snoop Dogg over here just with a cybernetic arm and has gone. Has uh, gained some weight here. It's actually really cool though. Uh, based on your own character... You can choose when you have, like, because I'm a cop, you know, obviously, I worked in the corporation, you have, like, your own little private line there, which I think is pretty cool, it's, like, unique. It makes that, like, your lifestyle is different. I think that's really nice. I really like that touch that your life, your, your choices actually make a difference, at least from the very beginning. I think those chances actually probably more affect you from the street street gang one just because uh at least from what i saw but being caught you know, being corp hey you know what i sound like a badass i know i'm talking about so <laughs> sounds pretty cool yes um so note to self i'll be cutting that scene all right uh so with that uh we are out of there 
uh, that would be really cool. So what we're doing is we have two options, right? First one is to meet Liz, and again she's gonna go over again brain dance, and you know again looking at this chip and why is it so special at least briefly, no spoilers. And then for the other part here, we're looking at getting a robot, like a spider-like flathead robot from the alien cyber geeks. So, uh, yeah, we're going to kind of track them down and do some damage. V-style. I mean, I would really love to, like, control some drones, like flatheads and drones like that would be sick. I don't think, I think that'd be quite OP, to be honest with you. So, I'm going to be doing here is, I'm just going to be quickly... And let's just go with Maelstrom. Let's just kind of get this over with here. Normally, I can get up there, but I'm just not going to go about it. So, what I'm going to do first of all, uh, I'm not really big on hacking. But one thing that I found that was very helpful for me is ping. Because ping really tracks all my enemies all at once. So, ooh, I don't think that is it. Okay, so we're looking for a ping. Uh, so not really looking for breaching, cause again, just not into that really. I'm just looking to ping, but I'm not seeing it. Ooh, ooh, that's how I do it. Okay, if I was go hacking, I would work on that, and also I would go with this. Those would be the two things that I would really look at. And something to consider. In this case, neither of these are anything I really need. To be honest. So, I'm actually going to peace. Be careful when you're actually driving. Because they actually can hit you. <laughs> yeah, your own car can be a douche. Yeah, imagine that. Again, based on the- I like the cars in this game. I do like the cars. I feel the one that you start with obviously is not very good and they do that on purpose. You know, why would you want to have- it just makes no sense. But the car actually are pretty good in this game. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, so I, I had some guns- I had some cars that are really cool. Uh, really nice, like really flashy. Uh, and yeah, they've been, they actually handled quite well. In that case, that gun, that car doesn't, but, you know, it is what it is. Okay, Jackie boy, let's go. Aya por fin. Vamos, amigo. Hay gente que matar. Okay, dude, like, okay, there you go. See, it can be a little glitchy at times, like... You have to actually like, rearrange it, like step back and then go forward, and eventually it works. Look at those ads. God. Everyone can see those. Probably more effective than a billboard. <laughs> okay. Dude, like. Hello. Hello. Let's go in there. <laughs> you fuck others, you get fucked. <laughs> you know what? I, I I'm gonna like have like little sliders saying, you know what? Things to live by. <laughs> and now what? Hint, don't be the one getting fucked. <laughs> Jack is easily one of my favorite characters, other than Claptrap and Brick. Alright, uh, so again, thank you for making it to the very end. 
Uh, again, if you like this video, again, I really appreciate that to really smash that like. And again, I hope to see you in our third part here. So again, uh, do tune in for that. Take care, everyone. Thank you.